The Philippines is shaping up to join the group of affluent Asian countries, and the Asian Financial Forum 2015 hosts Tony Tan Kaktiong. He is the chairman of Jollibee Foods Corporation, and he joins us from Manila. Thanks indeed. You're very much an entrepreneur, Tony, and I believe that you started by opening two ice cream parlors in the 1970s, turned that into an international corporation. What was your strategy for success? Was it a grand plan, or was it a case of step by step? Actually, we started uh, two ice cream houses way back in 1975. And then in 1978, we incorporated them into the Jollibee Foods Corporation. In terms of strategy or uh, vision, at that time, what we were doing is just to serve great tasting food at affordable prices. Way back do I have this vision of opening up this a big company. At that time, no, it was just satisfying the customers uh, every day. Even though uh, I don't have the plan of making a big company, but I remembered one of the uh, criteria in choosing the name was that the name must be able to withstand uh, registration globally. So even though at that time we only have a few stores, I think at the back of my mind, uh, there's this dream of uh, trying to dream big. So what's your outlook for emerging Asian markets? And as far as the Philippines is concerned, how do you see that in terms of consumer development? Oh, we like the prospects of uh, emerging Asian markets. And China, of course, uh, has already emerged and has more consumers with money in their pockets than any other countries in the world. Vietnam, uh, Indonesia, India, and all of these are growing. And also consumer demand in the Philippines will continue as our economy continues to perform. And more, of, more people will enter into the middle class as well. Tony, how important is Hong Kong as an agent for growth in China and the Asian region, and particularly for your own business in and out of Hong Kong? Hong Kong will always be an important part in the uh, China story. Our uh, business in Hong Kong is still uh, relatively small, but, we, but that store is one of our highest performing stores. So we expect uh, we'll continue the growth in uh, Hong Kong and uh, build more stores there. Now the theme for the Asian Financial Forum 2015 is the region's sustainable development in a world of change. What is that sustainable development as far as, say, your business is concerned? Oh, we have no doubt that the region will experience sustainable development and growth in, uh, in the coming years. It is the most dynamic, uh, probably, the region in the entire world. So what's the significance of the Asian Financial Forum to you, Tony? Is it a big deal? Do you expect major insights? Of course, uh, it will uh, have a great exposure on our company and uh, I think you'll bring a lot of uh, attention to the Asian uh, growth and the dynamism of the region. So it'd be a nice uh, venue for uh, a forum for uh, exchanging of ideas and lots of learning. Tony Tan Kaktiong of Jollibee Foods, thanks indeed for joining us ahead of the Asian Financial Forum 2015.